Today we're going to go over the installation on our 2005 Honda Accord on a draw tight hitch part number 24787. There is a difference in installation between a four and a six cylinder, so we are going over the four cylinder model today. Now before we begin our installation, here are a couple measurements that may help you in selecting the proper bike rack or cargo carrier. From the top of the receiver opening to the ground is 12 and a half inches, and from the center pin to the edge of the bumper is four and three quarters inches. To begin with, we'll need to get the exhaust out of the way, so we'll spray a little lubricant on the rubber boots and pry them out of the way, lowering the exhaust to make it easier to get to the bolt hole. Sometimes a pry bar and using a small block of wood will help aid in this removal. Now that the exhaust is out of the way, we'll show you where the location for the bolt holes will be. There's one on each side as well as using the tow hook. The two bolts on the side, one on the driver and one on the passenger, will use a 7 16 fastener while the tow hook will use a half inch fastener. We will start by using the thread bolt leader and fishing it through one hole into the other. Once the leader has been thread through, we will fish the reinforcement plate over the leader and then screw the bolt onto it. This bolt in this case is the 7 16 bolt. Once that is done, we will pull it through so that it seats into place. Again, the same step will be followed on the driver's side. Now that we have these two bolts in place, it's good to have a second pair of hands to help you lift up the hitch. Make sure as you're lifting the hitch, there's a center plate that needs to go to the left side of the tow hook for all the bolt holes to line up properly. Put the conical washer on and the nut. Now that we have the two bolts, the one on the right and the one on the left connected, now we will take the half inch bolt, start on the driver's side, feed it through so it seats through the tow hook, through the backing reinforcement plate, then the conical washer and the nut. Now that all the bolts and nuts are loosely put on there, you'll want to help make sure that your hitch is centered up and then begin to snug all. Once these bolts are snug down, you'll want to torque them to the manufacturer's specifications. Now we can go ahead and reinstall the exhaust. Now this concludes the installation of draw tight hitch number 24787 on our 2005 Honda Accord.